Today, I'll be evolving Iron Man from Mark II all the way up to the most powerful suit, Mark 43. All right, guys, the first suit that we're testing out today is Iron Man Mark II. I am so excited. Iron Man is literally my favorite superhero from the Marvel MCU. All right, so let's see. Um, as we evolve the suits today, we will gain access to new abilities and we'll be able to fly higher. By the end of today's video, my goal is to fly all the way up into outer space. We do need to be careful, though, because there are some of you guys on this server playing as Iron Man's with me. If you guys want to be featured in videos just like these people, all you guys have to do, make sure you guys join the hashtag cookie club that has two Bs. All right, so right now we have a couple different abilities. Uh, we have a power ability. I think we literally just shut down the suit. We can also just take off the suit if we want. The animation for putting on this suit is like the coolest thing ever. It reminds me of when uh, Tony Stark in, I think it was like the original Iron Man, made it so that like the suit can like fly and just attach to his body. Okay, so we can hit F in order to fly. That is insane. This screen's super cool too. So on the left side, it shows my vitals, my armor, my energy, my speed, and the status of the suit. Okay, so we can fly up, we can fly down. Let's see how high we can fly with this suit. Warning, reduce the altitude. Okay, so wait, what happens if we just keep flying up? This suit just shuts down. But wait, you can kind of see me going out. I'm, I'm falling. We're flying. I think I landed. Am I dead? <laughs> Yo, we actually died. All right, so that's the first suit. We have a lot of others to check out. So next up is one of my personal favorites, Mark III. Mark II, I think, was nicknamed the War Machine. Mark III was the first suit that Tony Stark actually added in, like, some of the, like, the red and gold to the suit that you guys know and love. Uh, what's this one? This one kind of looks cool. We can also use, uh, repulsors. Let's test it out over here. Oh, my goodness. Wait, can we just lock on to people? <laughs> What's up, Jerome? I'm beating him up. How much damage do we do? I'm beating him. I'm beating him up. I'm freaking getting him. Oh my gosh, yo. The dude said rocket. And then a rocket spawned in. Do I have rockets? Oh, I think I do. All right, wait, let's fly so that I'm not an easy sitting target. I don't want to be a duck. Okay, so I think I'm locked on to this dude right there. Oh my gosh, wait, I am. Okay, well, let's lock on to Jerome. Since they're also in Iron Man suits, bro, they're super durable. So we're going to have to hit them with quite a few rockets if we want to stand the chance of actually maybe killing somebody. This is awesome, though. And I believe this is still a work in progress. If you guys want to try it out, I'll leave a link in the description of today's video. It's completely free. All right, so we have to reduce our altitude. For whatever reason, the early Iron Man suits weren't able to survive super high up in the sky, as evidenced by me falling out of the flipping air, dude. All right, I'm still alive. Uh, can I toggle my mask? Oh, all right, sweet. Yeah, it worked. My suit is unfortunately powered down right now. That's why I don't have like the UI or anything around me. So, uh, even though I don't have any power, my arc reactor has turned off. Um, am I able to just like jump? Oh my gosh. Wait, are we going to die? We just face planted. So I think I can just like completely eject from the suit as well. Oh, yo. Yo, he's destroying my suit. Brother, that's not cool. All right, let's upgrade. Let's go all the way up to Mark 9. So the different Mark suits, are just like upgrades to the Iron Man suit. Every single one has a little change or tweak. So let's jump up a couple just so we can see some of like the bigger advancements that Tony Stark made to the suits. Uh, this one, I think includes like the time. Um, it also, I think might have a couple extra powers. Let's see. All right, so let's try to fly. There we go. Now we're moving. I love the look of this suit better than all of the other ones too. When Tony Stark originally made this suit, he tried to make a extremely advanced flying suit. So that's why this one should be able to fly higher than any other suit that we've tested out today. We're going up. We're going up. We are 300 meters in the sky. If I look down, it doesn't look like I'm that high up. I'm not going to lie. But then again, going from the ground level all the way up to space, you can get to space in probably like, it's like a couple miles at the max. So you don't really have to go that far up. But as we continue to try out the better, more evolved Mark versions of the Iron Man suit, we'll be able to hopefully fly all the way into outer space. But for the time being, I need to annihilate this man. He looks at me funny. The rockets are heat seeking too. Yes. Hello, sir. We shall duel. I'm going to stop flying here. Oh, that's actually, um, this just got really awkward. I accidentally got rid of my suit. No, let's call in Mark 12. Am I alive? <laughs> no. I died. All right, so I accidentally hit the key to lose the suit. Not my best play. Okay, let's upgrade to the Mark 14 Iron Man suit. Oh, snap. Wait, is this one blue? I can't tell if this suit is either blue or black. You guys will have to comment down below. But this suit looks sick. And look, there's just a random person standing by. Let's try out a rocket. Oh, my goodness. Wait, that dude just went flying. Yep, he is dead. All right, let's fly around with this suit. 
Wait, 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 reduce altitude? Hold on a second. Okay, so this suit doesn't have the same advanced flying properties as the Mark 12 suit that we just tested out. So I know that Tony Stark made some of the suits a little bit more like beefy and bulky so that they could be better for combat, while he made other suits really light so that they could fly around a lot quicker. So I'm guessing this was one of those more beefy suits. That's why when I go over here and I bop this man, he's gonna die super quick. Oh yeah, I beat the crap out of that man. I'm so sorry. This is so cool though. Oh wait, just like flying out of the sky like this and then just falling. We're literally skydiving and then boom, we can turn on the rockets. Oh no, my Iron Man suit, it turned off. What shall I do? Boom. <laughs> That is so sick. All right, so the game that I'm playing is super cool. Like, the fact that I'm able to play as all of these different Iron Man suits and actually shoot rockets and repulsors is so sick. I actually think there is a move that I haven't tested out, but it would be awesome in the future if they actually added in, like, some enemies around the map that you could just fight. Okay, so there's also a sentry mode. Oh, wait, wait, that's, that's me. Wait, I thought I would control my own body, but no, that's not the case at all. I am still controlling the Iron Man suit, but I can see my body. Right, what if I uh, take off my helmet? There we go. There is nothing inside. That is weird. From the side, it looks like his mouth is open and he's going to chop down on somebody. All right, so what if I just like punch myself? Oh my gosh. Bro. You can entirely leave your suit and then fight yourself if you want. All right, we're gonna make a big jump. So we were just Iron Man Mark 14. Let's go all the way up to Mark 21. This was a pretty big leap in terms of Iron Man armor. This was one of the first armors that looks entirely silver. It might actually be an upgrade to the War Machine series of armor. Let's try to fight this dude. Beat him up, beat him up, beat him up. Don't touch me. I don't know who's winning. My vitals are about at 90%. Seems like that's the case for this guy, too. Yeah, hey, oh, you try to shoot me with a rocket? I'll shoot you with a rocket, boy. Oh, no. Oh, this is... Don't... You don't have to do... I'm gonna beat you up. Why do I keep getting out of my suit by accident? Uh, we need to call my suit. Call Mark up. Never mind. <laughs> Wait, there's too many people here. Oh, we're gonna call Mark 23. Run, 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 run. Come on. Yes, dude, it's so cool to see the suit coming in. He's firing rockets at me. We were able to fly away without the full suit. That was awesome. That was just like something from the movie. I'm gonna try to shoot this man. Okay, so we use, what is it? E for the repulsor. I need to start learning all the controls because I'm gonna keep accidentally jumping out and deleting my suit. There we go. Blast him, boy. Oh, nice. We're actually doing like a lot of damage. Wait, he's flying away. Where are you going? Where did you come from? Where did you go? All right, this is another one of the Iron Man suits that can't really survive super high up. Like, we started to get the altitude warning way before we reached the tallest tower in this really awesome looking city. It's kind of a little bit annoying. I want to eventually find the suit that allows me to go all the way up into outer space. You would think by Mark 23, which is like pretty high up in terms of like the uh, the upgrades that Iron Man could get, you think that you would be able to get all the way up to, uh, to outer space by now, but no, you can't. Like, let's see, if I go up to the top of this tower, boom, it starts automatically giving out and I get to around like 240 meters in the sky, which is baby stuff. Literally babies could fly higher than that. Am I gonna die? Am I okay? I look okay. No, no. <laughs> I died. What's going on here? Don't you? Don't you just love when you spawn next to Tony Stark and he kills you? It's a great feeling. Get this dude away from me. Dude, we're getting spawn killed. My man means business. Okay, as soon as I spawn in, we are going to call Mark 30. Call Mark 30. Go. Please come to me. Yes. I'm gonna jump off this building. We need it now. Yo, that was awesome. Booyah, boys and girls. We're now flying through the skies. Mark 30 looks awesome. But this, what the flip? Bro, I can't even go that high up. All right, all right. I'm reducing my altitude. Don't worry. I will not reduce the amount of rockets that I fire at other people, though. That you can't warn me about. Hey, yo. I just got sniped out of the air. That was rude. This <laughs> dude won't stop. Let me up. Get away from me. Yes, okay, we have made it into the skies. We're soaring. As an Iron Man, you need to stay on your toes. If you don't, you'll get knocked out of the air like a fly. Where shall I go? The other kind of weird thing about this game is that everybody has access to the Iron Man suits. Anybody in the game can join and pick between Mark II all the way up to Mark 43. So there is no like pay to win. There is no like grinding in this game. It, it's not a simulator game. So like anybody could immediately go up and be like a God Iron Man. Okay, my new goal is to, uh, first off, we're gonna get out of this suit. There we go. Now that's just my helmet. 
Let's uh, let's actually leave the suit. Okay, so wait, if I leave the suit, what happens if I uh, what happens if I like summon the suit? Oh, that's kind of weird. My body just like merges with it. Oh, that's creepy. Wait, can I just like fly away with this thing? That's kind of cool. So wait, what if I what if I go and I just like fight people with my suit? That way, my body's safe. This is kind of like the Iron Legion. We could just use Senshi mode for all of our different Iron Man suits. Wait, my vitals are low. Oh, wait, is somebody fighting me? Am I dying? Okay, we need to merge. Merge with the suit. Oh, it just came apart, and then it comes back together on my body. That's a cool feature. I like that. Okay, let's get rid of the suit, and we're gonna jump up all the way to the Mark 40. The Mark 40 is one of the fastest Iron Man suits. Tony Stark made the Mark 40 suit to be the first suit that could fly at hypersonic speeds. Look at that, we're flying at 400 miles an hour right now. And it also has super good energy. So like I'm barely losing any energy and I'm able to fly around extremely fast. Now the big test for me is going to be to see if this thing can fly super high into the sky. Like right now we're, 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 doing, we're doing all right. All right, wait. Wait a second. Okay, we got up to five, almost 600 meters in the sky. That's crazy. That dude, whatever he has, he has the suit that can go into outer flipping space. Right now, yeah, we're uh, slowly descending. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll let you guys see the process here. Yeah, we're uh, we're probably gonna die. What if I what if I got yeah, uh, what if I take off the suit? Right? What if, what if we take off the suit, put back on the suit? Am I am I gonna live? Did I die? I have no idea what's happening. Oh my gosh, we did it. Did we live? We did. <laughs> no way. I can't believe that. I was falling out of the sky. I took off my suit and then the suit fell apart, went back and flew onto my body and somehow we lived. All right, but I don't want this suit. That suit's trash. We're upgrading to the Mark 42. This is the second, the best, best suit in the entire game. Oh, it looks cool. Oh, that's awesome. It has like a weird like tiger camo skin to it, which is sweet. All right, well, so what we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna just test out the rocket. I think the rocket and the repulsor might be the same for every single one of these suits. But the main difference is the fact that I keep taking off the suit by accident. Okay, this suit can't fly as fast as the Mark 40 suit, but it might be a little bit beefier. We're gonna find out, Never mind. Now, what, what, is, what is good? What is the purpose of this suit? Is this like a super powerful suit when it comes to armor? Like, why can't it fly super high? Okay, so supposedly this suit was codenamed Extremis. Um, it was an autonomous prehensile propulsion suit prototype. So like, why is it garbage, man? It should be so much better than it actually is. I'm gonna try to fly high without my body. Maybe my fat butt is weighing it down. No, I don't I don't think it is. And that's actually kind of funny. It, it teleported me all the way back to my body. So I don't know where my suit is. I can call it though. Hey, there we go. Wait guys, okay, I have a pretty cool idea. We're gonna go up into the sky. We're gonna just take off the suit. I'm gonna go in here. We're gonna call Mark 43 three the best suit available and oh my gosh wait that was awesome it was just enough okay let's see this one can't fly super fast we're at like 150 mark 43 is not the best suit when it comes to flying we gotta get rid of it okay what about mark 33 we need to find the suit that can go all the way up into outer space we're going up this could be it we're at 300 400 no is this some weird suit? Maybe it's like Mark 28. Nope, nope, it is. It is not Mark 28. I'm dying. Okay, Mark 40 is so far is the best suit when it comes to flying. Here we go. There we go. 500. No, dude, as soon as we hit 600, that's when it dies. We're falling. Oh, no. Don't worry, guys. I'm fine. Guys, I maybe found it. This is it. Mark 21. The suit that can fly the highest. This was the first suit that was specialized for supersonic flight. And I guess it was also one of the first suits that Tony Stark made that can travel into outer space. We've done it. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, 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 okay. I get it, I get it, I get it. We're gonna go back down. So we can survive just out of the atmosphere at 900 meters in the sky. Can I just like fire missiles down? That is awesome. That is so cool. Wait, is there another suit up here? Wait, there is. Can I shoot him? <laughs> Yo! <laughs> I shot him out of the sky. There can only be one Iron Man in space. You can be Iron Man on ice if you want. We've done it. We've conquered outer space. Now there's only one thing left to do. We reached the max limit, 1,000 meters in the sky. And we're falling all the way back down to planet Earth. Well, while we're falling, make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe. Also, check out the merch over at beckbrojack.co, linked in the description down below. I feel like I've been falling for a while. Oh, yep, there we go. We're dead.